All right, this is Rick and Tony from Fireside Fitness. Again, today we have a special guest, Chief Ted Smith. Chief Smith is here because he's an expert in, in extrication. He's been on a special operations unit for years. Um, one of our fans made a comment that, hey, you guys do more than fight fire. Don't you go on auto accidents? I just saw a big accident on I-95. Can you simulate that? At first I said no, then I said, yeah, let's do it. So today, this is just for training purposes. It's not gonna be perfect. You gotta let your imagination um, play a part in this. But we're gonna try to simulate an extrication first time we've done it, so give us a break. All right, so Tony's in the seat of misery. On command, command to engine 100. When you get to the scene, assume the fend-off position. Tony's on the scene. He's positioned the vehicle to shut the road down to protect our firefighters. He's gonna put some cones out. Once he gets the cones out, command's gonna say, I need a protection line down to the scene. He's advancing a protection line down to the scene. Line. Now he's on the scene, he's going to be given to extrication. So now Ted is in charge of extrication. Ted will go from here. Tony, what I'm going to need is to go ahead and stabilize the vehicle. Once you get all your tools staged in a good area. So what uh, what Tony's doing now is he's simulating staging, staging, I mean stabilizing the unit. So he's putting some chocks down. Um, we're using 20 pound dumbbells. Um, he's lifting properly, he's bending properly, and that's what we're doing in the training fitness type exercise that we do uh, at Firesplit Fitness. We have wires. What he said now is we have a wire on top of the vehicle. He's been okay. energized. He's been energized, yeah. So it's safe. Good, good safety message. Whenever you do training, you should always put some safety in there also. So now the car is stabilized and they're ready to go to work. So once we get the car stabilized, he gets his tools in the staging area. This is simulating your power unit for your AMCUS. It's uneven because you're gonna be in an uneven position when you're carrying tools. Now, what we're simulating, he's got some cutters and spreaders. Again, gotta use your imagination, guys. So we got cutters and spreaders. We got dumbbells, 35 pounds and 45 pounds. Kettlebells with chains to make it a little more difficult to move around. As you can see, we're always watching and assessing his lifting techniques and he's doing well so far. Got all our equipment. Tony, now I need you to go ahead and give me a purchase point. All right, we need a purchase point. We gotta get that door open. So we're simulating a purchase point. Gotta be careful, there may be a victim inside. All right, he's got that purchase point. What do you now, Chief? Go ahead and grab the spreaders and let's start uh, working on getting that door off. All right, so he's got his purchase point. Bending properly. Work your way up. All right, athletic stance. Back at the natural curve. He's got to hold that steady for a while. We all know how heavy these tools are. Boom, he's got it open. Right, go ahead and remove him out of the action circle. Back into your uh, staging area. Let's go ahead and get the door opened up a little further so we can make purchases. So, Chief, so Tony, we need to get this door opened up over here. He's going to push that door open. Good. Now he's got enough room he can work inside the vehicle. He's got access to the hinges. He's going to go ahead and cut them. So Extrication's got him cutting those hinges again. Look at his form. All right, we can go up to that top hinge. Somebody else will come in and simulate grabbing the door to remove it. The door is now removed. Okay, let's move it out of the, let's get that door out of the uh, action zone, Tony. This is simulating the door he's carrying out. As we know, these things get in the way, they become trip hazards, so he's getting it way away from the scene. All right, the victim is now out. So we need to get him out of the way of the, out of the, way of the accident. So he's gonna drag him a little way. Now, Chief, we do, we do a load and go. So go ahead, that, we're gonna simulate picking the stretcher up properly and engaging the wheels and putting them in. Boom, good job, the ambulance takes them off, we got another save. Good job, way to go, good job. That's it, guys, that's the simulation of an extrication, the best we could do, hope you enjoyed it. <laughs>